All right. So the coping box park is closed. They're doing some kind of construction on the street that leads up to it, which blocks access to it. So I drove 20, 30 minutes away to this shitty little skate park that has a coping ledge. It's a little bit smaller than what I'm used to, but fine. Last time I skated it, slid really well, so should be good. Let's uh, have some fun. I also brought my factions. I want to see if I can royale in them now, because I can royale in my fr oc frames which are taller than my creates so it should probably be around the same angle as trying to get it in my factions so we're gonna run through our tricks with our sls and then we're gonna try our factions again i'm starting to get more uncomfortable skating really low obstacles like this this is lower than my coping box by probably four or five inches jump too far on top of it Nice and smooth. Can't get too low on these grinds because the obstacle's su super low, but we'll do our best. This is good training for skating rails because it acts just like a rail. It's completely raised from the top. There we go. Let's get that to take you. Felt pretty good. There we go. I think that's fakey. Or off the ground got me there. There we go. really try to lock in the frame here this type of obstacle really exposes my uh, bad P star form need some wax man you need to feel good on rails those feet tight press my shins together all right I'm done with this trick we're moving on Whew. top ass time nice nice all right, let's hit a Royale. The issue with this is wheel bite is deadly because it's just like a rail. There's nothing for my anti-rockers to catch on. There's nothing for my wheel bite protection to actually work on. We got this. See, that's bad news, man. That's bad news. <sighs> Fuck, man. See, as soon as the wheel touches down. That's the lock-in. Fuck. Come on, we've done this so many times. There we go. Let's do that again. That was good. This is a good training spot. It forces me to be good. All right, here's the best one yet. It was slow.
I'm done. Faction time. All right, I am back on my factions for the first time since getting my SLs. The first thing I noticed is that I feel like I'm falling back because these are so much flatter. I do have uh, my intuition heel pad in there and the faction heel cup. So I have a little bit of heel raise, but not as much as my SLs. With that being said, we're gonna do soul grind and an acid probably, and then I'm gonna go right into top acid and royale. See if I can snatch those. I'm really excited to see how royales feel on these now. I was just starting to get them. At probably three or four sessions, I was getting my royales and the factions before I switched to the SLs, and then the factions never got touched again because royales became so much easier. Oh, that feels way different. Holy shit. All right, the first thing I'm noticing is I'm definitely getting the feeling of fall falling backwards, and the boot is just way more mushy. Also, I am using the same liner, the MyFit Fat Boy liner, and create original frames. I feel like Unities are probably easier than these two. Wow. Wow, that feels really, really, really sturdy. That might feel better than my SLs for top sides. This massive faction soul plate. Time for a house. All right, locked in. I got stuck. I'm so tired. It's been 45 minutes and I'm really bad at taking breaks. Alright, I'm done. I'm too late. Uh, can't even talk. I'm way too tired. Oh. But I got boot down in the factions. Peace.